Hey, so what's going on, Call of Duty players? It's me, Joe, bringing you guys another Moab gameplay. Of course, I, I'm having a lot of fun. Like, uh, it took me a little bit to get some Mo get some Moab gameplay. Actually, um, this commentary is pretty much going to be about this thing that me and my friend, well, my friend made. It's a new community called Gamer Sonja. Talked about it in my last commentary, but he told me I can, you know, tell everybody about it. Pretty much, it's gonna be a site where you advertise your clan, your YouTube. And stuff like that. But we also we also have a really detailed team that will be giving us like the most the fastest up to date news on all the, like really serious games out there like World of Warcraft, MW3, Battlefield 3. All those will be like like once they're released or like before they're even released like on many made sites they're probably gonna be on our on our stuff. We have a Teamspeak server. We have a website. You know, it's still we we're still building the website just a little bit. It's it's gonna be released March 31st and. Get ready, guys. This is going to be pretty big. I'm going to be a part of it. I'm going to be very, very active. Uh, pretty much it. And when that thing goes live, so is my recruitment center for my clan, Frostbite Gaming. I haven't really done Frostbite Gaming ever since it went down because of my ex-tech officer. Uh, I guess me and him got into an argument. He took down the website, pretty much destroyed my clan in the, in the, in the process. In the end, we actually, we're still kind of friends, you know, I'm at, just because, you know, things in the past, you know, fuck people over, we're still friends, you know, like, I might still piss at him for doing that, yeah, but in the past, lies in the past. Let's talk about this gameplay a little bit, I'll talk about a little bit more about Gamers Lounge in this commentary. This is probably one of my fastest MOABs I've ever got, and the weapon setup I was using was, si was a Silence MP7 with a red dot, and it's not my normal setup for this gun, but I accidentally chose this site, and I turn out to like this site, it seems so, like, seems like the shots, like, don't, don't quote me on this, because I know it's just a reticle, it doesn't have nothing to do with damage or recoil, it just seems to, like, it never fluctuates, you get what I mean, it just stays on the target, and that's a really great thing, and I don't know how many more commentaries I can be doing, because my Turtle Beach, <laughs> I know I'm switching this up in so many different ways. I'm sorry about that. My turtle beach broke. The other part of it was already broke, so I had to wear this like this pink headband just so I can at least you know sound or hear everything. Cause one of the headphones is like literally just hanging on like the little wires. I have a turtle beach X11 if any of you guys are wondering. And I'm gonna be buying some razor headset tomorrow. It's a really nice headset, seventy dollars at Best Buy. From what I heard, and a couple of my friends have them. They told me it's a really durable headset. Much more sturdier than the one I'm using right now. And that's a good thing, man. I'm telling you. Um, yeah, gamers. let's go back on Gamers Lounge. This, I I'm telling you, man. You ca I'll leave the website in the description if he wants me to. It Like, you just post your YouTube videos. It's like free advertisement, dude. And we got people. We're buying game servers right now. My friend bought Dogpatch, the guy who owns this thing. Bought Battlefield 3 servers. He's buying Modern Warfare 3 servers. And... You know, there's also like, you know, they're like, well, damn, this is all about PC, not console. Like, yes, there is a console part of it, too. But, you know, it, we have a team to come on, join the community. It's going to be really helpful. Like, if you need help with something, let's say that, like, you need help with an achievement on, you know, Spec Ops, I'll come in there, you know, help out anybody. It's just having fun. The main rule of this whole thing is to have fun. Don't rage, you know what I mean? Just have fun. That's, that's, that's the good thing about this. There will be moderators, there will be staff, and we will be trying to get some. And there's the MOAB. Love it. And I found this glitch a couple days ago uh, where you have your, like, you know when you call on the little thing with the little walkie-talkie radio thingy? <laughs> you can actually have it glitch where it's all the way out, and I think the only thing you can do with it, I think I think you can shoot with it, I'm not too sure. And there's the multi-kill! Love it. <laughs> there we go. And the, um, the sad thing about this game, we lose. I swear to God, every time I get a MOAB, our, our team loses. And I do really crap. Once I get the Moab, I start doing crap because I started to actually play the objectives because I noticed that we're still losing. I'm like, damn, I just got a Moab for you guys. Please, just at least cap some points. You know what I mean? And the guy rages at the end. And, yeah. And surprisingly, no one in this lobby has called me a hacker. And I think right here, I accidentally tabbed out because I was in TeamSpeak talking to my friend. <laughs> And it was odd, because I was on TeamSpeak just talking to him, and actually I would just cut out on a conversation we were having, it was dog touch. And, and I'll actually get him, maybe he'll be my dual commentary guy, because he'll definitely, he knows, I, he knows, you know, he can put the words in the sentence, you know, what it would really be about. Really, ah, holy shit, I can't speak worf crap today. Woo! <laughs> Pretty much this thing, March 31st, I'll put the website in the description, so, create an account. 
it's gonna be a really big thing, and this is my fastest Moab. Holy shit, that was pretty fast for me. <laughs> wow. Okay, I don't know what else to talk about. <laughs> oh, and I just got some, my friend was telling me that uh, the map pack's coming out in the patch update for the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 PC. I'm not too sure if this is, like, legit or not. Like, I'm pretty sure it is. But pretty much, they're going to be nerfing the FMG9s are really good again. Thank God, because I'm so sick of them being a three-hit kill. It's annoying as hell. They're going to be... I don't know if they're nerfing snipers. See, that's the thing. My friend told me that they were, and right when the map packs comes out. And a cool thing is, Call of Duty Elite is, is still in the works for PC, and that's kind of gotten me a little psyched. I don't know if we're going to have to pay for it. I don't think that we will, which is a good thing. And if we don't have to pay for it, then damn, another great free thing that those Xbox people have to pay for. <laughs> uh, but, other than that, uh, what else, what else, what else in Call of Duty news? Oh, I'm probably going to be doing another, I guess, gun show. You know how I used to do the assault drone if I go gun show? Well, that's really, really gay and lame. I don't even, about to delete those videos because they're so scary just to look at them. Ugh. I swear, like, I, I used to think back then, oh man, I couldn't 10 kill shake, but the, but the main thing about that series was about having fun about the assault drone, because it is a fun kill streak. I love just running around with a R2-D2 bot, whatever you want to call the damn thing. <laughs> it's a fun thing. And, look at that guy, that guy got me mad. <laughs> okay, pretty much, I ran out of things to say in this commentary, I don't know why, that's not like me at all. But... Yeah, like, put, I want you guys to put in the description, like, what for this next patch, what do you guys want to be nerfed and buffed? And I personally think that they should nerf the MK-14. I think they might nerf it, and I hope they do, because I don't think an assault rifle should have a two-hit kill, even though, yes, yes, it is a semi-auto, and, you know what I mean? But still, it's, it's just so overpowering, because I see a lot of people get MOABs with them. And another thing, this is the first lobby I got in a MOAB and not being called a hacker. Holy shit. <laughs> That's odd. And I almost got a mob with an AK-47. I got an 18-0 kill streak, I think, with it. And it was really nice. Then I got a Kimboed. It was on Dome. The guy spawns right behind you, right where C-Flag is. I was like, no! <laughs> but, you know. And that's another thing they need to fix is the spawn systems. I swear. It, it's not... I'm not trying to bitch or hate on the game. It's just saying. It's just some of the things that they really need to fix in this game that make it really great. Because... First, FMG9 comes. I can get used to the spawn system, you know what I mean? It's still gonna be really gay to get adjust to and stuff, but the spawn, but the spawn system needs to be, I mean, not spawn system, Jesus Christ, Akimbo's, Akimbo's in general just need to be fixed, you know what I mean? Kimbo scorpions are just monster now. I, I rather use those than any other Kimbo weapon, but if you notice in my videos, I always rock the MP9 with a silencer, just because... It's like, it, it's just so dead on and accurate and really lethal at farther ranges, so i rather use it for that, but hey, it's just my personal preference, and that's pretty much it, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for this gameplay and commentary, guys, I know it's a little stuttery and, like, holy shit, like, I, I have no, no notepad, it's just in the top of my head, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay, please subscribe, write up the video, like, put a like, and uh, if there's anything I need to improve on, put in the description below, that would be very highly appreciated, I'm in the comments, why do I keep on saying description, Oof. anyways, gay FMGs, gay, peace.